for this video because I have honestly wanted to film this for about two years maybe. So if you can't tell from the title, I'm gonna be doing an American candy taste testing video. So about two years ago, I was craving American candy because if you don't know, I have lived in America and then we moved back and I was just craving candy. So as you do, I YouTube searched American candy. There weren't really a lot of videos that popped up when I searched it, but I remember Emmy made in Japan or something like that and she had a bunch of taste testing videos and I just became hooked I loved it so I wanted to make one myself but I never did and now this concept has blown up everyone is making this video but that won't stop me because I still really want to make this video I love watching this video myself so I thought maybe you guys would like watching it too now like I said I have lived in America so I have tried quite a few American candies but I placed an order from americansoda.co.uk and I purchased things that I haven't tried or that I want to retry uh, but mostly I haven't tried any of this. I placed a huge order so uh, this is not even all of the things that I bought so if you want a part 2 of this video then please give me a big thumbs up and I will make sure to make one for you guys. I know that I always get hungry when I watch these kinds of taste testing videos so go grab yourself a snack and a cup of tea. I have my tea ready so let's just go ahead and start tasting it. Okay so the first candy I'm gonna be tasting is a classic that I have actually tried before. Hershey's Milk Chocolate. If you've seen a lot of these videos you've probably seen that a lot of British people don't like this chocolate and I never liked this either. I think the aftertaste is kind of gross. Uh, sorry if I'm <laughs> offending any Americans out there but I really have never liked this. Uh, but I thought I would give it another try because how bad can chocolate be, right? Okay, so I can immediately smell the Hershey's chocolate smell. Um, it doesn't smell terrible to be honest, but I remember really not liking this. Here I have a square and let's taste it. You know what? It's actually not at all as bad as I remembered it. Like, not at all. It's not good. <laughs> so I definitely prefer Maribo that we have in Sweden or Cadbury's. But I actually don't hate it. Not too bad. I'm actually going to give this like a good 6 out of 10. I'm really, really surprised. <laughs> or maybe I just liked it because I haven't had candy in a long time. I've been super healthy before prom and graduation because I really wanted to feel good in my body. <laughs> so I've been on this health kick. So maybe everything will taste good just because I haven't had any good candy in a while. The next candy I have is from a brand that I absolutely adore. I love Sour Patch Kids. But I've never tried the Sour Patch Peach ones. I've tried the normal kids and I've tried the watermelon. But I've never tried the peach ones. They're really, really small. They're just like this little peach. And I can imagine this tasting super good. So here we go. It's pretty good. I really like peach flavor. It's it's not bad. It's just not the best candy I've ever tried. It's not really sour at all either. The kids are a lot more sour. I'm probably actually going to give this the same as the Hershey's. A 6 out of 10. Really good and I could definitely eat more of these. But if I were to pick it out myself in the store, I would probably pick the kids or the watermelon. Alright, my next candy is from the brand Tootsie. as the Tootsie Rolls that I really love. And I bought the dots. These, I think, are just like big gum. Yeah, assorted fruit flavored gumdrops. And I've never tried these. I remember candy coming in boxes like this, like at the movies and stuff. Ah, brings back so many memories. <laughs> okay, so it has a lot of different flavors or colors. They don't really look too appetizing. Why am I only getting red and yellow? I'm just gonna go ahead and start trying them. I don't know if it doesn't say what flavor. Oh, yes, it does. So in the packet, there is strawberry, lemon, cherry, orange, and lime. Okay, so I am guessing that this is strawberry. Oh, it's really, really soft. No, that was cherry. I really don't like cherry flavored things. I love lemon flavored things. They don't really taste like a whole lot. Like they're not super flavorful. No. I'm gonna give this a four out of 10 because I would never pick this out 
myself. They're not gross, but not really good either. So another candy that I really did not like when I lived in America was Twizzlers. And everyone seemed to like them, but I just never did. I can't remember what I thought they tasted like, but I just didn't like them at all. But in some vlogs and stuff, I've seen people eating red vines that look just like Twizzlers, but from a different company, I guess. And um, I think some people prefer these over Twizzlers, so I decided to give these a go. So this packet came with a lot of red vines, so I'm just going to pick one up. I always see these in the movies as well, and they look so good, but I didn't really like Twizzlers, but here we go. What flavor is this? Cherry. That's why. I'm not a big fan of cherry flavors. It sort of tastes like I could imagine a body mist tasting like. Like sort of perfumey. It's fun to eat though. It's like, like I feel like I'm in an American movie. 3 out of 10 I think. And I'm sorry, I feel like I don't like any of this. I feel bad. But, I didn't expect to really love this one since I don't like Twizzlers. Oh my god. I just made a straw. So most British people that don't really like the Hershey's milk chocolate that I surprisingly didn't hate today love the Hershey's cookies and cream white chocolate. Since I'm closer to England geographically, I can imagine really loving these. Oh my god, they're so cute! Look at that! They're little drops of um, like white chocolate with cookies inside and it has the little Hershey's logo on them. They smell, they sort of smell like cookie dough, which is kind of weird, but I'll give it a go. Mmm. When I first put it in my mouth, I was like, it's not as good as I had hoped for. But then when I started chewing it, oh my god. You know what it tastes like? It tastes like an Oreo that you have already dipped into milk, which everyone knows you should dip Oreos into milk. I'm gonna give this a 9 out of 10 because it's not the best chocolate that I've ever tried, but it's super good and I could definitely pick these out from the store. Oh my god! If you like Oreos and if you like white chocolate, definitely try those. Next up we have one that I already tried when I lived in America. But I've never tried it in this format, and I don't know if the flavors are going to be different. I think they are. Um, but these are Airhead Bites. I remember, I have so many good memories from Airhead, but I've never tried Airhead Bites. And these are berry flavor. I remember the blue raspberry and the white mystery one. Those were my favorites. I'm going to start off with blackberry. Mmm, I love the texture of this. It doesn't taste at all as I remember Airheads. I'm gonna try the blue raspberry, which was one of my favorites. They don't have a super strong flavor. They mostly just taste like sweet sugar. But they're pretty good, like they're really fun to eat. Let's try banana berry. Sounds like a smoothie I would make. <laughs> that one is probably actually my favorite. I'm gonna give these a seven out of 10 because they're not like up there like my favorite candies ever. Bye bye bikini body. <laughs> okay, the next one is from a brand that I loved um, and I'm talking about Jelly Ranchers but I've never tried them in jelly bean form. I remember my favorites were the green apple and the blue raspberry. Okay, I'm gonna try my favorite one first, blue raspberry. It has the exact same flavor except the sugar coating outside like that makes these hard makes it taste less like the Jolly Rancher and more like sugar. Now I'm gonna try the strawberry one. That one was super bad. Okay, now it's good. It was just the shell. That shell tasted weird. Okay, now let's try the orange one. That one is really good. I love citrusy flavors. Let's try the last one, green apple. Mm. Okay, let's do it like a medley. All right, for a final Jolly Rancher jelly bean taste, let's take my two favorites and combine them two into a green apple, blue raspberry, 
medley. What? No, I keep dropping them. Mixing it up. I think I've come up with a new flavor. Jolly Rancher, if you're watching this, try mixing the green apple and the blue raspberry because that is delicious. If I were only to grade the green apple and the blue raspberry, I would give this a 9 out of 10 because I love the Jolly Rancher flavor. All in all, I like the hard candies better um, and I don't really like all the flavors in here. So in all, I'm going to give this an 8 out of 10 which seems very generous now that I think about it, but it's better than the Airheads. But I only have one thing left to try in this video. Oreos Minis with Reese's filling. These are like two of my favorite treats in one, so I just can't wait to try these. Oh my god, and oh my god, have you guys watched The Parent Trap where, you know, with Lindsay Lohan, where she dips the Oreo into the peanut butter and eats it, and I... I remember after watching the movie, I started doing that, and then Savannah told me that she also does that, so that's our little thing, the Parent Trap Handshake and the Parent Trap Oreos. These seem like an already made Parent Trap Oreo. Let's try it. Oh my god. They're so good. 10 out of 10 all the way. What a great way to end the video. Okay, I need one more. This video, one of the best videos ever, because I get to try American candy. But like I said, I haven't really picked out things that I already know I love. So if you feel like I didn't like most of this, it's because I picked out things that I haven't tried. Alright, so I really hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I loved making it. If you want to see an American taste testing video part 2, and then make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Yes. Please leave me any feedback or any American candy suggestions that you want me to try in the comments down below. Or maybe if you're from a different country, if you want me to try your country, then I can try to get hold of your candy. Because I kind of want this to become a reoccurring thing because who doesn't like tasting candy? <laughs> I think that would be super fun. So definitely make sure to leave a comment down below so thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys again next week with a new video bye